my name is Nisal Vinayak. I am studying in third set in ACS two. There is no doubt that health and cleanliness goes hand in hand. A healthy body means a clean body, and these two cannot be separated. Let us understand health and cleanliness with the help of this model. There is a village called Adunagar. Villagers used to throw garbage all over the place. They were very lazy people and never did any form of exercise or sports. They spent majority of the time on gadgets and television. They never followed any proper routine. People in the village enjoyed eating unhealthy food. Because of this, they suffered from different diseases, muscle and body pain. They also suffered from mental mental tiredness and stress. They became fat and dull. One day, a noble person called Guru visited Aranagar. Guru told the villagers that. India has given the world two wonderful sciences, Ayurveda and Yoga. Guru asked the villagers to adopt healthy habits based on these two sciences. First healthy habit is eating healthy food. Both the sciences give importance to what to eat, when to eat, how to eat, and how much to eat. As per yoga, we should eat half of the stuff. Full of solids like chawal, roti, sabji, and one fourth should be liquid like water, soup, buttermilk, etc. And one fourth should be empty. Second good habit is manage stress with yoga. Asanas and meditation techniques help them to help them to improve their focus, mindfulness, and breathing awareness, which help them to reduce their anxiety and stress. Third good habit is spend time with nature. It is very necessary to have a walk in the fresh air. It is good for our overall health. Fourth good habit is follow a routine. Guru schedule their day by limiting the time spent on gadgets and television. Fifth good habit is drink plenty of water. It is very necessary to drink enough water and other fluids to keep our main organs work efficiently. Sixth good habit is to do regular health checkups. It is very necessary to keep a track of our own health to avoid small illnesses becoming a big disease. Seventh good habit is be physically active. Guru engages the villagers. Into different physical act, into different physical activities and sports, which help them to reduce their weight and energize them. Eight good habit is maintain hygiene. Guru taught them about maintaining a personal hygiene. Villagers also started putting garbage in the dustbin. Hygiene is not just about keeping our house, schools, and offices clean, or to brush our teeth, taking bath every day, etc. But we rarely talk about wasted removal from our body and about our mental health. Both play an important role in keeping our body healthy. Thus, Ayurveda and Yoga help the villagers of Anandagar to be Become mentally and physically fit. I I have started following this healthy habit because Mahatma Gandhi ji has said, "Be the change you want to see in the world." Thank you.